Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Usman and today I'm gonna be showcasing the new race car library version of Jester and the Massacre. So before we start, I would like if you guys could go check out my music video teaser. Let me know what you all think and also subscribe to my Vivo channel if you are interested in seeing my music video. It's gonna come out pretty soon. So the links for the teaser and for my Vivo channel will be linked down in the description below. So so now, with that being said, yesterday we got the new Christmas DLC and I actually covered that information in my previous video, letting y'all know what's new and all, things like that. So if you want to know what we got and what we are going to get in the next few days, be sure to check out my previous video, the link will also going to be in the description below. So like I said, Christmas DLC came yesterday and today I'll be showcasing the Massacre and the Jester race car versions. We do have these cars already in the game, we got them way before but now we've got a newer version of these vehicles with awesome looking stickers, Rockstar named them the race car livery versions. So as you guys can see the Massacre race car costs 385 grands and the normal version of the Massacre costs only 275 grands. If you already have the normal version of the Massacre, honestly you don't need to buy the race car version, it's not worth it. But me have to buy it anyways just to show you guys how it looks like but I'm gonna say this, the new race car version looks sick, I think it's cool that Rockstar added this in GTA 5 and in GTA Online but it would be better if they added that race car paint job in the mod shop for I don't know for about 50 grand or something like that so people who own the normal version of these cars can slap that paint on their normal versions because the race car version is too expensive so I'm gonna take this car inside of Los Santos customs and I'm gonna customize it I'm gonna step up the stats for this vehicle and I'm gonna respray it as well just to change the color so here we are, it looks awesome with the new upgrades, especially those neon lights and the roll cage that I painted with frost white paint as well that giant Dubashi wing hanging on the back of the Massacre. Personally, I really like the Massacre, it has one of the best handling and it's really cool when you do drifts with it. I highly recommend you to purchase if you have a lot of cash in GTA Online. Moving on, we also got the Jester, so the normal version of this vehicle cost 240 grand and the race car version cost 350 grand. Personally, I prefer this over the Massacre, not the normal version though. I prefer the Jester race car over the Massacre race car version because that red and white sticker combination it's pretty awesome and unique, and in my opinion, it looks super sick without the Jester wing on the back of the car. It also has great speed and handling, nothing too special about it just those stickers look super sick and I'm gonna say this if you get to choose one car when you have the Massacre and the Jester get Jester baby because the race car version is pretty sick but hey it's just my opinion if you like Massacre better than Jester then get Massacre so let me know what y'all think let me know which one you prefer better the Jester or the Massacre let me know in the comment section down below so if you did enjoy today's video though make sure to smash that like button also share this video with your friends who are interested in seeing or buying these new race cars and also if you are new around here make sure to press that red button down below to subscribe for daily awesome GTA 5 videos and last one not at least be sure to follow my social media Facebook Twitter and Instagram for daily GTA 5 updates fun and awesome pictures and a lot more so that's really about it Oh no, no, wait, not yet, not yet. If you are still watching and you made it to this part of the video, I wanna say you're awesome. Make sure you comment pizza in the comments below so I'll know you made it to this part of the video. But what I wanna say is that I'm going to host a giveaway. I wanted to host Shark Cards giveaway and give some of them away on Christmas Day, but unfortunately I couldn't. But hey, I wanna start this giveaway sometime in January and I'll be giving away Shark Cards 
cars before heists, so y'all can buy those new cheesy vehicles, helicopters, especially the Hydra jet, which I'm pretty damn sure will cost around millions of dollars. So I'll be giving that away on Facebook and on Twitter. I just wanted to give y'all a heads up. By the way, let me know what should I give away a one Megalodon, eight million dollar shark card, or five. 1 million dollar shark cards let me know and give me some random ideas about what should I give away but hey keep it real don't exaggerate by the way happy holidays take it easy and peace out guys